Today, we're diving into an exciting comparison between the C7 Corvette and the C8 Corvette. Stick around as we break down the pricing, engines, performance, and design of these iconic cars. If you enjoy my Corvette content, please hit the like button and subscribe to support this channel. Pricing Starting with pricing, the C7 Corvette, which debuted in 2014 and ran through 2019, has become a more accessible option in the used car market, with prices ranging from $40,000 to $70,000 depending on the model and condition. In contrast, the C8 Corvette, introduced in 2020, starts at around $69,000 for the base 1LT model and can climb around $82,000 for the top of the trim 3LT, and can even go higher with some options. The C8's mid-engine layout and modern advancements do come at a premium, but it offers a lot of value for a modern sports car. Engines Under the hood, the C7 and C8 Corvettes showcase their distinct engineering approaches. The C7 Corvette is equipped with a front-engine layout, featuring a 6.2-liter V8 engine producing 455 horsepower and 460 foot-pounds of torque in the base Stingray model. For more performance, the C7 Z06 ramps it up with a supercharged 6.2-liter V8 delivering 650 horsepower and 650 foot-pounds of torque. The pinnacle of the C7 lineup, the ZR1, boasts a supercharged 6.2-liter V8 engine pushing an astonishing 755 horsepower and 715 foot-pounds of torque. The C8 Corvette, however, introduces a revolutionary mid-engine design with a 6.2-liter V8 engine generating 490 horsepower and 465 foot-pounds of torque in the base model. The C8 Z06 takes it further with the most powerful naturally aspirated 5.5-liter V8 engine ever, producing a stunning 670 horsepower and 460 foot-pounds of torque. The main beauty of this engine is that like exotic supercars, it has a flat-plane crank, which makes it sound spectacular. This mid-engine layout enhances weight distribution and handling, marking a significant departure from the C7's traditional design. Performance Performance comparisons reveal the evolution of Corvette engineering. The C7 Corvette Stingray achieves a 0 to 60 mph time of around 3.7 seconds and a quarter mile time of approximately 12 seconds. Meanwhile, the C8 Corvette Stingray surpasses this with a 0 to 60 mph time of just 2.9 seconds and a quarter mile time of around 11.2 seconds. The C8's mid-engine configuration and improved aerodynamics contribute to its superior acceleration and handling, making it a more formidable performer on the track. If you have made it here, please like the video and subscribe to the channel, thank you. Interior and Exterior Design and interior quality highlight the advancements made with the C8. The C7 Corvette features a bold, aggressive exterior with a front-engine layout, which makes it keep more of a muscle car-looking design, and it sure does look spectacular. Inside, it offers a driver-focused cockpit with a mix of luxury and performance-oriented materials. The C8 Corvette, however, takes a completely different approach to the exterior and interior. In the exterior, the C8 Corvette looks like a European supercar, with elements from cars like Ferrari and Lamborghini, which will sure attract attention on the road, but departs from the traditional muscle car-like design. The interior of the C8 is maybe the biggest change and is for sure a significant upgrade, featuring higher quality materials, advanced technology, and a more modern, luxurious feel. The driver-centric cockpit and improved ergonomics make the C8 a more refined and comfortable place to be. Verdict The C7 Corvette and C8 Corvette are significantly different yet also really similar in some ways, but mainly attract different types of fans. If you like the muscle car look and want a raw driving feel, then the C7 Corvette may be the better option to look at, since it is also cheaper. However, if you want a supercar for not supercar money, and want to draw attention, while also having a factory warranty, then the C8 Corvette may be the perfect one for you. Let me know in the comments which Corvette you would go with.